joint replacement's been around for 40 plus years. It still involves putting a metal and typically plastic implant inside the body to replace a very worn arthritic hip or knee. Um, but some of our surgical approaches, our anesthesia has changed, our post-operative physical therapy approaches have changed, and all of it is focused on really allowing patients to recover more quickly and ultimately have a better long-term outcome. Really, if you think of a joint replacement, I guess you can think of it in four uh, pieces. Um, the first is the femoral stem. Uh, that fits inside the femur or the thigh bone. You can have a metal femoral head or a ceramic femoral head. That fits, of course, on the femoral stem. And then two components fit in the acetabulum or the socket of the hip. One is, a, again, a metal-type component with a coral finish that bone will grow into. And then there's the liner. Traditionally, the liner is a polyethylene or a plastic liner. That liner has changed over the years, so the plastic liner lasts longer than it used to. It can be ceramic as well, so that's certainly an option. And there are metal-on-metal -metal options, but those have had a lot of problems in the past five or ten years. So it, certainly in my practice, metal-on-metal -metal is virtually not an option. Volume really matters. We do a lot of joint replacements at Suburban Hospital. Again, the nurses, the therapists, the whole hospital kind of understands how to take care of a joint replacement patient. They do it on a regular basis. They've seen patients on, on every end of the spectrum. So they really know how to handle each and every patient well. We have a total joint program coordinator who's constantly watching over the whole program to really bring, keep it up to the highest standard. Uh, and then we coordinate, I think, well between the, the medical team, the surgical team, the anesthesia team to really all, you know, work together for the patient. What it really comes down to is a doctor taking care of a patient. In orthopedics, we're a specialty that really works on relieving pain and keeping someone very vibrant. And I guess selfishly, that's very rewarding as a doctor.